UFO reports in New Mexico are already up for 2015, and this is typically the time of year when sightings surge. But before you prepare for some alien invasion tonight, you will learn what's really going on high in the sky. We are going to see more and more of these visitors from space. New Mexico is ground zero for UFO lore. There's nothing to hide at all. The Roswell mystery changed everything in 1947. Socorro in 64 added to the intrigue. UFOs and New Mexico kind of go hand in hand. Paul Garver is assistant state director of MUFON New Mexico, the mutual UFO network. MUFON is the nation's oldest and largest civilian UFO investigative group. Garber expects some strange sightings in the sky to start pouring in the next couple months. It's easy to be confused, but their appearance is very strange. In fact, when I've seen them, my first reaction is, what the heck is that thing? So it's perfectly natural. These aren't visitors from another planet. From New Mexico. Ready. Four high altitude balloons will launch from Fort Sumner in DeBaca County. The balloons are from NASA's Columbia Scientific Balloon Facility to study everything from the atmosphere to the origins of the universe. Reports will be coming in, and our goal is to help people understand in advance that what they're looking at is most likely one of these balloons. They are a remarkable sight. They're way up in the sky, they're fairly large, they will vary in color silver, white. Uh, and depending upon what's in the atmosphere, it may, they may look orange or red. Uh, so they're really quite unusual. And often they'll be reported as UFOs. The National Weather Service says clear evenings will give the best views of the balloons off to the east. Folks in the Albuquerque metro area could potentially see them. Uh, we do think, however, the better viewing of this will more than likely be out across the eastern plains of New Mexico. This is research by Americans, not aliens. But that aside... <laughs> New Mexico remains the land of enigma. Have to check out that movie again. The balloons will be launched starting tomorrow through October. Now, if you see something and you don't think it's a balloon, you can report a UFO sighting to MUFON. They also are looking for some volunteer field investigators. Log on to KRQE.com to be linked up.